Hey, my name is Ev the Weirdo. I do art shit. Every time I come in the kitchen, you in the kitchen. In the goddamn refrigerator, eating up all the food, all the chicken, all the pig feet, all the powder green, all the hog maw. I want to eat some of them chicken. I love pig feet. Let's just start off by saying that I hate raisins. Uh, hey, uh, so I decided to make a YouTube channel to talk about me, myself, and my art. Duh. Every single time, you know, I start another clip, it's like my hat is doing like a, you know, 360 on my head. But I want to start off by saying that I appreciate every single one of you who either likes, dislikes, subscribes and watches my channel you know you gotta watch to like it you gotta watch to dislike it and you gotta watch to subscribe to it so thank you for all of you who do that mm. there's a couple things that i like to get off my chest first things first i'm the realist no <laughs> I ate a raisin. Oh my god, it's nasty. Oh my god, my lips look ashy. Oh my god, this shit is really nasty. But I'm gonna keep on chewing, keep it classy. Ew, ew, ew. So I should probably start saying something because I've been doing a lot of bullshit in this whole damn time. Just doing a little QA. My bad if I spit some stuff out. Just been eating some trail mix. Oh, wait. I hate raisins. Oh yeah, um, decided to do this YouTube channel so I can, you know, get my art out there, you know, let people know what I'm about, about that art life. <laughs> a little uh, Q and A, like a get to know of the weirdo. I asked a few people, more than a few. You know, what, what should I talk about? Uh, what questions would y'all have for me or what would you like to know? Uh, my real name is Evelyn. It's actually Ev the Weirdo. You know, I went and got it changed to Ev the Weirdo. E V T H E W R D O. No, I'm just kidding. Or am I? I am from uh, Louisiana originally. I am currently in Texas. I have been here since Katrina hit, actually. And I have not been back since I've been, since I was eight, 19. Uh, I would love to go back. You know, I still have family out there. It's definitely something that I plan to do soon. Hmm, sounds like an idea for a blog, right? <laughs> Um, I get asked about my age a lot. Well, you look so young. How old are you, 20, 18, 21, 22? I will actually be 29 on June 18th. Yeah, I know. That's crazy. <laughs> I am black in Honduran. Honduras is in Central America. Can I speak Spanish? Uh, un poquito, because it's bado. <laughs> nah, but I think I can understand it better than I can speak it. You know, I know I'm slack lacking on that part, but I'm gonna get it together. I'm actually pretty tall. Uh, this seems to be something that people like to know. How tall am I? Uh, like. I think I'm 5'10 and a half or 5'11 or some shit like that. I'm tall, all right? I'm just up there. I'll be in the clouds all the time. <laughs> it's great up here, actually. A lot of people are probably wondering, why do you call yourself Ev the Weirdo? That's weird, you weirdo. And I'm like, no shit. That's the whole point, you weirdo. <laughs> so anyway, um, I've always been different. 
you know, whether it's, you know, the type of music that I enjoy listening to, the type of movies that I like to watch, you know, the different foods that I like to try, you know, just had a different perspective on a lot of different things um, from everybody else. You know, I, I still did the normal kitchen, you know, run around, play around, you know, ride your bicycle, go uh, rollerblade and go chill with your, with your friends, you know, go to the skating rink. You know, stuff like that, but I've always liked to draw and I've always been quiet, shy in my head and people took that as me being weird or different. So, I just stuck with it because I am embracing who I am and if my weirdness is what makes me me, then uh, so be it, as the weirdo it is. And I'm pretty sure at some point throughout this video, you're gonna be like, she weird and goofy. But she keep it real though. Mm. Be a weirdo, but be the good kind. Because there's a bad kind and there's a good kind. And I'm the good kind. I'm gonna go, okay? <laughs> I started drawing at a very, very young age, you know. I think I was in elementary school, like maybe kindergarten or something like that. Um, as a kid, I was always the first person to wake up in the morning. You wake up, you like. You sleeping? Oh, you sleeping? So you're bored. So my ass was instructed. I was told to go downstairs when I wake up and put a movie on, which was always The Lion King. I know that movie by heart. And I would just chill down there until it was time for everybody to wake up and you know, I could eat breakfast. Breakfast. Fist, AKA. Sometimes a coloring book was left on the table for me. So it started, you know, me coloring in the coloring books. Then it went to me uh, tracing what was in the coloring books until it, you know, went to me drawing what I saw in the coloring book. So I would always just draw what I saw and it just went from there. If I ever were to stop drawing, I would always pick it up eventually because it's just something that's in my blood. I probably shouldn't say that. Uh, nah, it's in my blood. <laughs> Fucking weirdo. <laughs> Am I single? Hmm. Well, yeah. But that's not important. <laughs> One of the questions or a few, a few people wanted me to talk about being gay. God, did she say gay? Gay, gay. Like, gay. Gay. <laughs> if there could be a picture of gay in the dictionary, it would be my face like this. Yeah, that's an ugly face. <laughs> yeah, I'm a lesbo. So my first girlfriend, I was 14. I was 14. Yeah, I've been gay a long time. You know, I think I'm a professional at the, at the gayness. This is my favorite song. Mm. I love it. It's just like really sexy. The beat is so nice and everything is just like a real smooth, smooth bah, type vibe. And it's very like meaningful. I know that I didn't probably get to a lot of different things, different topics. Um, I'd like to know what questions you guys have for me, what you'd like to see, what other topics um, you'd like for me to discuss. Should I do like chat and paints, chat and drawing, chatting and, you know, eating? That could be taken uh, in different ways. Uh, anyway, just let me know what your thoughts are, what your suggestions are, what you'd like to see. And as always, I appreciate you. You know, love, peace, and, and uh, elbow grease.